Hi, welcome to Kativi 5 video tutorial. Today I want to show you how to get into admin mode. So Kativi is running in administration mode like this. Then you can edit all the settings which are usually grayed out and not available. So let's have fun with Kativi 5. First step, we want to copy our existing Katia link. So go to copy and paste it. Give it a different name like Katia admin. And then open not open but right click go to the properties and copy that path or target right here control C and open your notepad or your editor and paste it there let's make it bigger maybe 18 okay now we want to change that that's the path and we want to change this one the cut start exit to see next exit okay the path may be not the same on your system but go for the cut start exit and change it to see next exit and then change this to slash admin not slash but stroke admin okay and select it and copy it paste it back into that target and okay and try it will not work but let's see We will get an error message that some sort of environment variable is not set. So we have to take care of this issue. Let's close that one and check. So let's take a look at that path. Okay. You see that folder we are looking for that folder because there is this file so um, what we have to do now is to go to that folder it's inside the broken data this is a folder which is not visible by default you have to make it visible but that's just a windows thing so go to your folders Go to C and there's the program data and you can show and hide it like this. Okay, so there it is. Double click, go to the dissolved systems folder. I got two, one is for draft side and that one is for Katia. So I go to this one and then there is already another folder which I could delete by the way. Okay, and that's the folder we're looking for, and there's one file. So copy this file, make a new folder, and call this one admin. And for example, so maybe like admin env. Okay and paste the file there. Open that file by double click because it's a text file. What we have to set is that path. Okay, this path should be set. So I put mine on C and I'll point slash And I call this. Uh, I've called this Katia under line admin. 
Okay. Save this file. Close it. Go up. And let's see. I got one folder, Katia admin, on my C drive. So all the settings will be saved there. What we have to do now is to change our path. It should not go to cat env, but I think I called it admin env. Should check broken data, possible systems, admin env. Yes, that's the correct setting. Copy this one. Go to the properties and paste it there. And OK. So if we did everything correct, we should be able to enter admin mode in Katia. So double click. And we are in admin mode. So now we are able to change all the settings, even those which are usually disabled. So I hope you enjoyed this one. I hope it was helpful. If you liked it, please give it a like or leave a comment. If you want to see more, please give it a like or leave a comment. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please subscribe to my cat. cat no, sorry. Please subscribe to my Facebook cat fan page. And please like it. Would be very nice of you. And I will follow with up with a video which will show you how to activate the bending annotations in Cat V5. So thanks for watching. See you to the next one. Bye bye.